All right, guys, um, it's still June 4th. This is the next video of a, I don't know how many video series, so prepare yourself for that. Um, I just did an introduction of the tractors. Bear with me, I'm still trying to wake up. It's been a long, uh, it's been a long go here for me, but we're gonna start with the 9560RT John Deere. And we're gonna go for a drive with it, okay? We're gonna go for a drive. This is the tractor that Jared was always running during the seating. It is rocking the 13.5 liter John Deere engine, I do believe it is. We're gonna let this thing warm up here for a few minutes. All right, guys, that's good enough. It's already hot outside. Ooh, she's gonna be a warm one there today. So let's uh, let's just drive this puppy. We're gonna we're gonna go right between these two tractors here. So Mike, why are you starting with the John Deere, man? The fence just got dropped off. You're starting with the John Deere. Uh, I don't know. I just wanted to start with the John Deere. I definitely need to put my seatbelt on. Once you drive this tractor one, once or twice, you realize that that is a needed, needed device. So what we're about to do here is we're just gonna, I'm gonna take it to a rough spot. We're gonna drive over it. We're also gonna go down the road. So uh, let's go down the road first. All right, I'm just getting it to the road here. Sure, no one's coming. This thing is definitely rough, that's for sure. Okay. Let's see if I can do this with my knee and shift and hold my phone. This thing shifts better than my four track does. A lot quicker. Let's see if we can't put ourselves in the ditch here. Holding my phone. We're gonna see what our top speed is. Speed is 26.2. So one thing you gotta be very careful with the two track is you don't get too aggressive with the steering wheel or you're gonna be going the opposite direction very quickly. So obviously I'm still waiting for uh, John Deere to bring us a uh, new 9 series to uh, rip around on. Uh, that would be your, really, that's going to be your best comparison and I know that. But this is what we have. And I'm hoping John Deere is going to be a little bit more, Mother Deere is going to be a little bit more tactful this time around than they were with the X9 debacle. <laughs> So far my coffee mug has not left the coffee holder. That's a positive. I'm serious. We're just gonna go down to these trees and then we're gonna turn around. Settle down. Washboard, that's bad. Oh boy. Wow. Whoa, we got coffee flying here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Woo! We're coming in. Oh boy. It's still there. It's still there. I don't know how Derek drives this thing. Oh, 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 oh. Woo, woo, woo. We're only doing 7.4 miles an hour. We don't dare go faster. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Oh, this looks rough. This looks really, really rough. Ah, wasn't bad. Wasn't bad. All we're doing is just wanting to do a donut. Oh, oh. Fun fact. I got married in these trees. Are we gonna fit between these trees? Oh, we're not gonna fit. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Just going to make it. We won't come back this way next time. 
This branch looks low. This was a mistake. Oh, we're gonna just miss it. This was a mistake. This was a mistake. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Did you know that you can almost launch yourself? All right. See you guys back at the farm. I don't know how long I should make this video. I don't know if I can get all these drives in one video. I kind of doubt I do, but I don't know how this is all going to work. So uh, please bear with me. You might be, you might just get a whole whack of videos. So let me just tell you that. There's our hours. 4,126. This tractor has given us a lot of uh, um, death burn issue. It doesn't have death, but uh, it has to do with burn all the time. And uh, lots of times it doesn't want to do a burn. If it can't do a burn, it would just shut you down. So that's gotten really annoying. Okay, we've now done the road test. That was just the road test, you guys. We know it's max speed. Now we're gonna do the rough test. Oh lordy. Okay. Shift this thing down. Oh boy, this is getting rough here. We've been hauling in dirt for more bins. We have two scrapers on the back of that uh, RX. So you see that ridge? Yeah, we're going to go over that ridge on a bit of an angle. And we're not going to go too fast here. We're doing five miles an hour. Oh. oh yeah, this is always boot hill. There's always a boot hill. Bit of a grain bag pile. We get people to come in with semi-trailers to come pick those up. Okay, we're gonna cross this one very slow. It's a bit of a ridge. About two feet. Oh, wow, that was violent. <laughs> Spilled coffee. We're gonna go down this side. Wow, okay, okay, okay. Now we're gonna do a donut here and we're gonna go back up. This is our donut checker. Oh, okay. All right, yep. We're basically a cat, aren't we? We've got a little bit of garbage here. We got to do some cleaning on, but uh, I don't know if I can. I don't know if I should even try to go up that, but uh, we're gonna try. We don't. We don't plow into the front here first. Hold on. I just want to go up this in first gear. Maybe. 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 Okay. Maybe not. Okay. Maybe not. Cause I'm gonna go whoop! That's what's about to happen. Mike's getting a little crazy in here. Okay, we're gonna do a donut check right here. That's gotta be something we gotta do. We're gonna go just slow right down here. Can we turn on a dime and leave two cents change? Oh, I think we can. Oh, I think we most definitely can. As I just peel the track off here. 
Awesome. Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're gonna go up over this lip at only two miles an hour. Because I'm terrified. Okay, we're going we're going first gear here. First gear, first gear, first gear. First gear, first gear, first gear. Oh. Wasn't bad. All right, guys. That's enough playing around on the 560. Oh, but we got to go down here, don't we? I think we do. We're going to do our vertical test and see if we can't keep the front of our tracks on the ground. How we parked our grain augers here, uh, it's gonna be kind of tight, but I think we can get it done. Uh, well, I'm just gonna go down over here. I, guys, I haven't pre-scripted record, I don't do that. I'm literally just driving with you guys trying to find the different things that we can do. We've hauled a mountain of dirt in here, as you can see. Ooh, okay. Hello, Grain Auger. Now we're gonna go up. I hope. First gear. Feel like I need a little more weight on the front of my tracks. Okay, we're gonna stop right. Woo! A little floaty here. Put this thing in park, I hope it's gonna hold it. If we had a runaway, that'd be bad. Go out and take a look. Awesome. Well, there you guys have it. That is the John Deere two track. Now, if only I had someone here to hold my phone, I put it in gear and uh, let the clutch out. I bet you this front of the tractor pops up. I'm not gonna try and do that on purpose. I'm just saying that that very well could happen. Oh. Yep, it did. I felt it. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, wow. Wow, that was rough. Okay, guys. We're off to go get the, uh, which one should we do now? Which tractor should we do? We know that the Fent 1050 will be the smoothest. I can tell you that. It's got gigantic tires. It will be the smoothest. You don't even really have to try it. But we probably still will. Um, let's do the... Let's do the Fent. Let's do the Fent, you guys. I'm just going to park this tractor right here. I'm not going to take it back out on that grass. And uh, right here. Okay. This has been fun. We're going to have so much fun, you guys. Uh, guys, I already reached like a time limit already. So uh, looks like we're going to have to do one video per machine. I don't know. I, I guess I was probably dreaming to think I could get four machines in one 20-minute uh, video. That's stupid. Hey guys, stay tuned. It's only going to get better from here. We haven't even talked about what we're going to pull with all these things yet. And we're going to pull something. So uh, stay freaking tuned. You guys are, you guys are awesome.